Hi, everyone. We are here interviewing one of our new favorite people, Denise Phyllis. From, uh, are you from Australia or New Zealand? You live in Australia. Are you Queensland. Kiwi? Queensland, Australia. Yep. Awesome. And um, Denise is our one of our newest diamonds in our business, which is a huge accomplishment. And she's 83, but I remember meeting you on our trip down there. And both my wife and I were like, we love her. Got the most amazing attitude. And really, um, network marketing is kind of a, a test on your attitude with a paycheck attached, you know? <laughs> <laughs> so we'd love to hear, we'd love to hear what caught your attention about Vitafy. What was your why? Like, you guys have been pre launched It's a little bit more work to build the business down there. What, what, what made you go, like, we're doing it? And... Um, <laughs> kind of what's maybe some insights you might have for people yeah well first when i first saw the video the three minute technology video um um i was blown away i'm not a technical or scientific person in any way but i saw that and it made sense and it's it's done in such a way that the average person can understand it and i thought this is going to be an amazing product because of the inflammation issue and i, I knew everyone had inflammation including myself I was looking for something to use for the arthritis in my hands um, and my daughter told me about it from New Zealand and I thought, yes, I'm jumping on board this. I've got friends that need it, family that need it. Uh, so it was a no-brainer basically for me. So I started to learn as much as I could and I started sharing with everyone I could think of. And because I was so passionate about um, getting people on it and seeing results for them as well as myself, um, it just names seemed to pop into my head that I hadn't thought of for years. So it was I sort of opened up 100 percent to it. That's that's what the difference was. I didn't go in and think, oh, I'll, I'll try it and I'll wait and see if I get a result and then I might tell one or two. I just jumped in um, both feet and thought, yes, I'm not finished yet at my age. There's still something for me to do. There's still a mission to accomplish. And uh, I absolutely knew it was great, knew the company was great. I read up. And, and uh, so there's nothing to sort of stop me going full steam ahead. Took me four weeks to get my own pack and I didn't have a product to try, but I had actually got to, I think Senior was heading to master by the time I got the product because I was passionate about sharing it. And I thought if I don't tell people, who will? Yeah. So you were you were telling people for their own benefit, not necessarily for yours. Yes, definitely, definitely. And I saw that was the That's point. The subtle thing that people miss. Then when they pull back, well, I'm not sure I want to tell it. It's like, well, you, you're typically because you're like, feel this weird thing like I'm trying to profit off of the mm. relationship instead of like, I'm going to give you something amazing because you need it. And yeah. if you don't want it, you know. Well, actually, I actually totally believed everybody needed it. And I thought, yeah. well, this is a gift being given to me at this age in my life. Um, and as I said, if I don't tell them who will, they might never find out and they might be stuck with some of those ailments or whatever forever. So, and I just want to put it, to me. it wasn't like, oh, who, what will I think of me doing this? It was just it was just a beautiful gift to share. If they took it, great. If they didn't, I just moved on. Yeah, that's a huge perspective. So how did you kind of like transition from just telling people about the product to also talking to people about the business? Um, well, first of all, it was getting them getting them a bottle to try. And Rebecca, luckily, my daughter had some. She sent it around. I, I gifted it to a lot of the family first and some very close friends. Um, so they got it. But uh, I made sure and she made sure that they knew it was something very valuable that wasn't just, you know, I think the important thing is to put a real value on it. And when you're handing it to somebody, you say, this is a very precious gift I'm giving you. Because if mm -hmm. you don't put that value on it, they yeah. just think, oh, well, yeah, it can sit there and they don't bother trying, which did happen with my girlfriend. And um, I rang her and reminded her that she had a very sick daughter that I'd gifted a bottle to as well. And I said, if you don't try her on this, you're not, you know, you're not looking after her properly. I, I really called her to action. You're not on pulling it. any punches. <laughs> no. And uh, she said to her daughter, my best friend Denise has gifted this to you. I want you to try it. So the daughter felt compelled to take it and she got 
in amazing results quite quickly. So, you know, what I was doing, I had my belief behind it. I had the company, I had the product. Uh, I love the technology of it. So I had all that behind me. So I didn't need the product so much to share around as um, as my belief people actually believed me. So, um, and, and that's my thing. If you totally believe in something that you're doing, you don't apologise, uh, you don't pull back. There's no holds barred really. So yeah. that's the way I went and I did it really quickly because I realised with both the product and the business, if you don't move quickly, you'll be just sitting there weeks, months later with nothing happening. Um, everything goes cold. So a good idea has to be moved on quickly and you need to get the product to people quickly. Yeah, absolutely. Get sort of a sense of urgency behind it. Definitely. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Yeah. Yep. Absolutely. And put a value on it, a, a great value on it that, um, you know, this is something we've never seen before. Uh mm -hmm. It's, it's brand new. It's fantastic technology. Just try it and see how you go. Awesome. With Without mentioning any disease conditions, what are some of your favorite things you're seeing the product do for people? Uh, definitely uh, brain fog's a great one, and that sometimes can take a bit longer, but uh, pain often goes quite quickly. People mention that they that after a couple of days, a few days, the pain levels drop. Um Energy, more energy, definitely. That's one that I see all the time. Um, sleeping better, that's another mm -hmm. one. So those things, and we're not making claims or claiming to cure or heal, but we are saying if you if your body can work and get the inflammation down, it can then start healing and repairing things that it didn't have a chance to do while it was blocked. So yeah. I think people understand that in the simplest terms. If you keep it really simple and don't say too much, that's much better than giving them Perfect. overloading. That's mm -hmm. like textbook because those are the benefits people are actually looking for. No matter mm -hmm. what technical disease condition they may have, they just want to feel better. I like I want more energy. I want less pain, better sleep, mm -hmm. more energy. Just simple. Mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Yeah. And, and that will change someone's life because then they, if they have that, then they can go do what the really life's calling is. You know, they have more life in their body. So, oh, definitely. Question. When did you start sharing about the drops? Um, as soon as I heard, it was virtually straight away, straight away. Do you away. remember um, your, your enrollment date? Um, 15th of March, and I didn't get my product till I think it was the 14th of April, and I yeah. didn't have a bottle to even try, but I absolutely believed in the technology and, and the results that people would get if their inflammation went down. I thought for sure people would start to feel some good things happening or, or lessening of pain or bit more energy or something I just because of exactly what the product was and the, how quickly it went into the bloodstream as against the other things that you know they may have been using that went into the gut and were sort of washed away quickly so I, I'd sort of understood the technology of it staying in your body for 24 hours um, reducing inflammation so that the body could then start and do what it was meant to do so I understood all that it was, and it's so simple to understand it you know to me yeah. Love it. Just so in six it. months, you've basically, I mean, impacted untold lives. Yeah, and have I you had so. fun doing it? Oh, yeah, I have. Mind you, there's been some stressful moments um, and dealing yeah. with some, some difficult people. And I find sometimes the people that ask you for a million questions and you go back and get this and you get that for them and something else, um, they're mm. really, in a way, they're not thinking about helping other people I don't know if they're sort of stalling for themselves or they have to have be that overloaded with information before they share. But um, I just had those basic things, a couple of um, testimonials and those videos to go on. That was enough for me. I didn't want to overload myself or anyone else. So, yeah. um, yes, just telling them about it, what it could do. And because I, I felt so excited, I think I got other people excited. <laughs> so, the, so the people who are kind of high maintenance, ask a million questions, <laughs> Are those the people who actually help build the business or, or is it the people who kind of have a gut feeling? Not at all. It's the ones you talk to and they first of all think of, oh, my mum's got this or my grandmother or my sister or someone's children. They think of them and they really want to help. They've always wanted to help but felt helpless. And finally they have, <clears throat> if you like, a tool in their hand that they can offer. And there's no guarantees, but it's that hope. 
You're giving people hope back. So that's that's how I saw it. I could offer hope, and if people took me up on it, great. And if they didn't, they they weren't in the right space, I guess, or the timing was wrong. <clears throat> so that's sort of, yeah, yeah, absolutely. So um. I have, I'll put you on the spot a little bit. Do you have kind of um, a favorite moment that you've had since being involved with this company mm -hmm. or involved with this product or a favorite sort of testimony? Anything along I, those lines? I, I, yeah, I do have. And <clears throat> one of the things I love is when somebody that I've talked to, they've joined the business, they've got results themselves, mm -hmm. but the, the penny hasn't quite dropped. Mm -hmm. And seen it with a couple of people one girl up here particularly that came in quite early into the business she was getting really good results um mm -hmm. i was working with her just nurturing her along if you like not pressuring in any way and um she got a friend involved who just went really crazy quite quickly mm -hmm. after months and months and for some reason this girl suddenly my friend just got it it clicked mm -hmm. and you should have seen her go she ranked up three levels from she'd been a rapid got rapid pro. She ranked up three levels in about two weeks from senior to master to premier. She's now at premier. We're getting her to elite this month, wow. and she's getting she's taking all my bottles, <laughs> waiting yeah. for her to come. <laughs> Love uh, it. And she's giving them out left, right, and center. And she's just it's just she just turned the corner because I think she had some blocks and some fears, and we yeah. worked a little bit with those. Um, but I wish it her pace, not mine. And I think the secret is if you go at the other person, if you know something about them, you learn about them and you know what how you can help when to when to not help, um, and be sense very sensitive to them. And then when they when they finally get it and click, you know, can they be can be doing all the right things, but nothing really much is happening. They'll they'll move up a rank and they'll slip back because they haven't sort of picked up the whole if you like, the whole big picture of it and, and what's required of them as they're moving up the ranks, like to start caring for people, start guiding and um, nurturing them, I guess. So it, it's important to grow with this business. And, you know, and I'm still growing um, at this age, and it's fantastic. I love growing. I love learning. I love becoming a better me. And this is the opportunity for that. There is an incredible amount of personal growth in this but you need to you need to see the challenge for what it is and work out a way to overcome it. And once you're through it, you have grown spiritually as well. Yeah. So that's yeah. how that's so true. affected me. Yeah. 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 Um, you said that your favorite thing to do in the business is to help people, help kind of like cast a vision or help them to reach their dream. Can you tell us just yeah. a little bit about how you do that? <clears throat> Yeah, well, if it's somebody I haven't met before and don't know, but I know they're in the business in someone's group that's in my group, um, I'll have a little chat with them, I'll find out a little bit about them, just not being nosy, but just, you know, friendly, interested type thing. Mm -hmm. And um, and then, you know, we, we talk about, I'll ask them why they got in, why they joined Vitify, why they're taking the product, that type of thing. So I'll get the idea then and I can work from that then. And then I can start to say something to them like, you know, if this business really worked for you, you you've got great results with your health uh, and you started to earn some some money and that may not be the reason you got in. But if that happened, what, what would you do? You know, what would you do with it? And I asked them and I did that with a young girl and um, she said, oh, God, me, me and my partner in their 20s, we want our own house and we want to design our own home and then we want to travel. And I said, oh, where would you travel? And she said, oh, we want to go to Italy. And I said, oh, I love Italy. I've been to Italy. It's the most beautiful town. So you're joining in with their vision with them and, you know, getting them to expand. And she, that young girl, um, we had her around home here with a couple of girls that are in it. She just walked out on a real high because... She, it was more than just, you know, it wasn't say sign here, sign you up. I never yeah. say sign people up. It's not a term I use. It's, it's sort of insulting. It's not respectful. My thing is let's get you your own pack. And by your own pack, I'm including them in the group of us and we'll look after your type of attitude rather than, oh, God, how do I sign this person up or how do I get them to get their pack? And it's not about that. You're, you're doing this for them. It's not about you. That yeah. really yeah. Yeah. It, yeah. I have one more question for you, and then I don't know if Stephen has more, but um, now that you've reached this rank, you know, 
how are you celebrating or what uh what do you have as a vision for yourself moving forward um I suppose it has it has sunk in, but it hasn't because it's, <laughs> well, it's only been a few days. It's not like I've reached a plateau. It's like there's another there's another ladder there. And um, and Rebecca said to me the other day, and she's she's my enroller, as you know, my daughter. And she said to me the other day, just after August, she said, "Well, um, well, when what day do you want to go double diamond?" And I thought, "Oh, okay," <laughs> to think about it. And I, <laughs> I said, it. "Oh, the." The end of November, and she said, "Oh, okay." So, but it's not about getting to double diamond. It's because I've been able to, in my own way, with my own skills and talents, and I've got I've made every mistake in the book. Don't worry about you know with the technical side, but it's it's about helping more people, and it's about getting the people in the team already up to the level where they feel a joy in the business. They feel they're making a difference, not this stress and strain and how will I get this person signed up, but a joy in, gee, look at how many people I've helped. It feels so good. So it's a feeling yourself of, that you, you've got a mission, you're contributing still no matter what age you are, whether you're a 19-year-old or you're an 83-year-old or a 90-year-old. And I said to Rebecca, well, what do you want me to do? I have to live to be 120. <laughs> <laughs> and she so laughed, fun. you know. Here's a question for you. Um, you're very much focused on other people, but if I asked you, how has your life benefited from more income? Like, are uh, you what are you able to do that you couldn't do before this came to you? Because that's important, you know. Yeah, it is important. It is important, and and I'm not I'm not a goody goody that just wants to help other people and not get anything out of it. <laughs> I believe this this business is uh, you know I love paying it forward, but also the benefits I've had have been able to um, have Rebecca come down and we went around Melbourne and and did all the tour with you in New Zealand, pay all the airfares, so pay fun. the Ubers, have meals out, uh, buy things for my great grandchild, uh, travel as much travel as I can fit in before I'm <laughs> before I can't do it awesome. anymore. So visiting family, we're going down at Christmas in Melbourne for my brother's 80th and then I'll be able to tack on going to Warrnambool, which is about three and a half hours away, and stay with family there. Um, so just family for me and being able to do things for my family and, and if I feel like it, to, to buy a pack for somebody that I know would really benefit but is absolutely they can't do it and give a few free bottles here and there where really needed. So, um, and having the money to do that, that and just, it's like getting the gift of the money, but then giving the gift back out again with, by catching up with family or giving bottles or, or occasionally buying a pack for somebody and saying, look, pay it forward. I don't want it back. I want you to pay it forward. So you're teaching them what this yeah. is about actually. That's love amazing. It. Wow. Love you it. are such an inspiration, Denise. I we <laughs> loved meeting you. Oh, I, I do have one thing because a lot of times people, if they have real simple clarity, it helps them. Mm -hmm. Like what like if you're reaching out, like you're like, oh, so and so really needs this. Um, you know, how are you reaching out to them? Kind of what what is, how does that conversation and interaction look? Well, it's basically when I speak to people, just saying, have you heard of curcumin or turmeric? And everybody usually says something like, uh, yeah, I take uh, turmeric and I do it this way with the black pepper or whatever. Or they say, I, what a lot of people say, oh, I've heard of curcumin. I think, I think I should be taking it, but I'm not. And you know the <laughs> funny thing? I've yeah. never taken turmeric or curcumin in my life before this, but I vaguely knew about it. And then when I saw it in this form, I thought, that's perfect for me because the other, what I'd ever heard before about it didn't appeal to me, didn't get through to me, but it's it got, this got through. And I think that's the secret. If, they, if you tell someone and you know straight away whether it gets through, because my best friends, when I told them about it, and I was pretty excited, and they said, oh, yeah, there's so many of those in the chemist, you know, completely deflated and flattened me. It could have, but it didn't. And I thought, you've oh. got no yeah, you've got no idea. So you were bulletproof. So, yeah. Mind you, so you, they're in the business yeah. now. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I love there it. You go. A lot of people don't handle that initial, like people raining on the parade, but you're like, I, I I recognize that about you right off the bat. You're like, I'm not asking anybody's, you know, opinion on this. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> mm, mm. Well, I was told don't don't contact people in other businesses because you know they might lose their position in that business. 
And I thought, well, to me, everybody needs the product. And if I don't tell them who will, oh, they'll miss out. And it's not in competition with any other product. So I had, I was, it was clear sailing for me, just go and do it. So I, there was no ob obstacles in my way. People put objections there, but I brushed them aside. So because of my belief and my um, mission, if you like, I felt, yes, I have to do this and come out of doing virtually nothing in retirement, just doing what you want to be and quite busy now, but getting a real joy out of seeing it click with people finally and seeing people rank up and, oh, honestly, the, the personal growth that's happening in some of the trainings we're doing here is just incredible to watch, really incredible. It. It's beautiful. It. Yeah. Well, we're super proud of you. Um, excited to see you hit double diamond too. Yeah. I totally can see that very <laughs> easily. Absolutely. Um, especially totally... when product really starts flowing in Australia, New Zealand. Yeah. Like, yeah. watch yeah. out. <laughs> this, yeah. this month is going to be amazing. Just I yeah. feel like, really feel in my gut, this month's going to be amazing here. Most people have got their product. There's still a couple complaining and whinging, but uh, they're not looking at what the big picture is after when we turn around and say, oh, I remember why back in um, August, September, when we had those, you know, all the shipping, you know, waiting for our product and everything. I say, yeah, yeah, you know, it'll be brushed aside because this yeah. the, big, the picture's much bigger than I haven't got my pack yet. Yeah. Sure. Well, you'll Absolutely. be sitting on some... Uh beautiful vacation that vitify is paying for chatting about these days <laughs> yeah <laughs> you're yeah, such an inspiration not. not and it's not just because you're you know you're an age that some people just are like done and they're not feeling like they're contributing or they're not wanting to work anymore anything like that mm. It's, mm. you're an inspiration because of who you are and who you are has been shining through this business that's benefited your team it's benefited all of us who've gotten to meet you um, you're just a beautiful person inside and out. And so we just feel very honored to know you. And uh, it's our pleasure to just recognize this accomplishment that you've made. And uh, we know that it's just the beginning for you. Yeah. Yeah. My wife, well, after our trip to Australia, New Zealand, she's like, I love all those people. We have to go back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're a different breed, aren't we? Like Australians and New Zealanders, let's say jump in with both feet more. They're, they're and they sort of forge ahead and say, well, you know, we don't care what the obstacles are. We're still going to be telling people. And I think yeah. that's a great attitude because uh, so many people, they get a block in front of them. Oh, I can't do this. I'll give up, you know. But yeah. the block is there to make you grow uh, mentally, emotionally, and particularly spiritually so that you can actually start to really help people um, yeah. move through their blocks. So it is about it's about personal growth as much, I think, as anything else when you so think true. about it. It's so yeah. true. Awesome. Well, that's it. I think we appreciate you yeah, we giving of your you time so today and oh, thank you. some insights. I know a lot of people in my group are really going to, it's going to fire them up. They'll be like, okay, game yeah. on. Oh, <laughs> yeah. 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 Love Get it. those yeah. obstacles out of the way. Get those obstacles yeah. out of the way. Just go. <laughs> Keep sharing yeah. those nuggets with us, Denise. We need them all. Pleasure. Yeah. Pleasure. Perfect. Lovely to see you again, guys. And see you soon. Thank you so much. See you Bye -bye. Soon. Okay, bye.